One of the things you'll notice in your new Canon G7X Mark III is the additional communication tab within the menu. If you navigate across to the purple menu, this is where you can make adjustments to the Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, GPS, and also upload for live streaming. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can connect your camera to your smartphone device. The first thing you need to do is select the option that says Wi-Fi Bluetooth connection. This screen will show you where you can print to a wireless printer, upload to a web service, or connect a Bluetooth wireless remote. In this case, we're gonna press the smartphone. Once we've selected the smartphone icon on the camera to transfer your photos across, we need to get the information of the SSID and the password from the screen, which we'll enter into our network settings on the phone. So I'm gonna grab my phone, go into the Wi-Fi options, locate your camera from the network list. Now it's prompting me for a password. The password is displayed on the back of the camera. It's a series of numbers that you need to enter into your phone. Great, once it's connected, you simply need to jump into the Camera Connect app. When I open up the app, I'm prompted with an option that says, a new camera has been found. Do I want to connect to the Canon PowerShot camera? Simply select yes on the screen, and on the camera itself, do you want to connect to the smartphone? You need to press the yes there as well. Now I've made that connection, I've got the ability to live remote shoot, so I can operate the camera remotely with my phone. I can adjust the settings, the shutter speed, the aperture, I can take photos, I can do all the adjustments that I would normally make on the camera, but now I can control it from my phone. This is really handy, particularly if you're wanting to take some family portraits or you want to maybe pop the camera in an unusual shooting location and you can stand back and take photos and operate it from your mobile phone. So a very handy feature there. The next option that I have with the smartphone app is to view the images on the camera. So when I click through here, I can see some images that I've saved on my memory card. I can download them straight onto my mobile phone. So connecting your camera to your phone really is that simple. If you've had some difficulty doing this in the past, I just recommend you go back through your menu, find the wireless communication settings and clear the settings back to scratch. Follow the steps in this video and I'm sure you'll see how simple the process can be. Another option that we have for our connectivity is to connect it via Bluetooth. Bluetooth is very simple. We're gonna go through our menu settings select the Bluetooth option and we're going to pair it. With our smartphone, go into your settings, select Bluetooth and locate the camera. This is a really quick way that we can automatically transfer our images from the camera and save them straight to our phone as well. I hope this video has helped you to get the most out of the connectivity features that are available to you in the Canon G7X Mark III. For more information, please head over to our website at canon.com.au.